Fernando. Hello. Okay. Hi, everyone. Hi. Today I would like to talk about commit messages. <laughs> Very important. It's funny how we, in our organization, we have this huge backlog, so many features, so many things to do, and we are discussing commit messages. I don't know how. It's yes, ma'am. Git, GitHub, SPN, if you are a bit older, but anyway. Commit messages. We noticed that in our organization, different teams were using different styles in their commit messages. Some people were starting with lowercase, with uppercase. <laughs> some people say add something, some people say add something. So it was a mess, more or less. So we decided that we want to create a standard for that. Well, not create a standard, but align people on how to write commit messages. And then after some research, of course, we found that someone already try to solve this problem. There are many guidelines, many useful recommendations on how to write commit messages. But we found something that we have been using, and it's very useful, called conventional commits. This is also a standard, a guideline, on how to write our commit messages. And it proposes some keywords. For example, not only keywords, but also formatting. So if you are creating a new feature, you use fit. If you are fixing a bug, use fix. If you are refactoring, use shore and several other keywords. But the very, very nice thing about that is that you get tooling on your commit messages. For example, if you, all your commit messages are using this format, you can generate automatically change logs because they will know what was fixed, what was introduced, and so on. And they also give you keywords for breaking changes. So it can also automatically bump your versions if you are using semantic versioning. All that automatically. So we get already like Git hooks that now we, we even have linting for commit messages. So it's another linting layer. Your commit can fail because your message is too long, it's too short, it's not using the format. And yeah, so far we have been enjoying it a lot. We get nice tools. Nice conventions are when you do git log, it looks very tidy. And I really recommend everyone to take a look if you find your commit message is a problem. It's called conventional commit. Thank yeah. you. And I can actually confirm this is this is awesome, awesome approach. We use uh, git uh, committism, committism yeah, with yeah. Uh, plugins. Yeah. Uh -huh. Awesome thing to keep it tidy and clean. And uh, that's it for Blink Talks for today. But did you like it? Did you like yes. this format? Yes. 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 So we will now do this regularly.